Today we are going to be making Coca-Cola beef short ribs which are going to turn out very flavorful, tender and delicious. The best thing about this recipe is that it's a one pot recipe which is going to be just perfect for lunch, dinner or any occasion that you have at home. So you'll need a kg of beef short ribs and a couple of other ingredients which you'll find listed in the description box on the right quantity. You're going to get started by searing your beef short ribs and this is how mine look like. So I'm going to add in. So you're going to add in some black pepper. And salt to your beef short ribs. Go in with your hands and massage in the black pepper and salt into the beef short ribs. Once your short ribs are fully coated with the black pepper and salt, it's time to sear your short ribs. So you're going to place a heavy bottomed pot over high flame and add in cooking oil. Once your cooking oil is ready, you're going to place in your short ribs and please don't overcrowd because we need to sear the short ribs. So you're going to sear for one minute per side. So that is what I'm going to be doing. Sharing the short ribs is going to add in a lot of flavor, so don't skip on that. This is how your short ribs should be looking like once you're done sharing. So I'm going to transfer to a plate and then I'm going to be adding in my next round. And as the short ribs are searing, you're going to prep up some fresh ingredients. I have around four large onions over here, which I've chopped up into medium sizes. Also, I have six cloves of garlic that I've grated and some fresh thyme straight from my kitchen garden. Check on my short ribs. My next round is ready, so I'm going to transfer to my plate as well. And the kitchen smells absolutely incredible because of searing the short rib. So in the same oil, I'm going to add in my onions. Reduce the flames to low so that I can caramelize my onions. And cooking the onions in the same oil is going to add in lots of flavor. So to help me cook down the onions, I'm going to be adding in a little bit of salt. Stir in the salt. And that is going to take around four to five minutes of slowly cooking the onions until caramelized. This is how your onions should be looking like after caramelization. To my pot, I'm going to be adding in my garlic and stir in. for around 30 seconds until the raw garlic flavor is gone caramelizing the onions is going to add in lots of sweetness and also flavor to the short ribs so take your time and caramelize your onions my garlic is ready so i'm going to be adding in 
a tablespoon and a half of tomato paste if you can also use switch the tomato paste with fresh tomatoes that is around two tomatoes stir in let the tomatoes let the tomato paste and the onions cook for around 30 seconds Then next I'm going to add in dark soy sauce, three bay leaves, Worcestershire sauce, around four dashes of Worcestershire sauce, stir in. This is the best sauce for the short ribs. Then I'm going to add in 350 ml of Coca-Cola. And two cups of beef stock. Bring the flames to high and then I'm going to transfer my short ribs into the pot. Lastly, I'm going to add in my fresh thyme into the pot. So I'm going to all the top part of the thyme and remove the leaves. The thyme also is going to add in lots of flavor to our beef short ribs. If you don't have the fresh thyme, you can also use the dried thyme. Make sure the short ribs are fully immersed in the delicious sauce and then I'm going to cover and bring this to a boil and once the pot comes to a boil i'm going to reduce the flames to medium low and simmer for around two hours two hours because we need the short ribs to be very tender so please take your time and the outcome is going to be very delicious this is after two straight hours of slowly cooking my sh beef short ribs. It's been two straight hours of cooking my beef short ribs and they're looking very good and delicious. You can see the sauce has thickened up and also the ribs are falling off the bones. That means that it's super tender and just mouth watering. <laughs> I'm super excited for this one because I always make short ribs and they always turn out delicious. So this is a recipe worth trying. And I love serving my short ribs with some mashed potatoes or even spaghetti. Yeah, I love having mine with spaghetti also. Rice can also go so well with the short ribs. And trust me, if you try out this recipe, every time you're going to be cooking beef short ribs. You'll notice that the beef short ribs also have a very nice dark amber color because we added in the Coca-Cola and also the dark soy sauce. The flavor is just so good because we used lots of onions and also garlic. Um, the bay leaf has also added in a very nice flavor to the beef short ribs, so this is totally worth trying. So thank you so much for watching and I hope you'll take your time make this beef short ribs recipe and you won't regret it. Catch you on my next episode.